Good morning. It's Saturday the 6th of January. We're back in Shillam for walk 10 of the North Downs Way. This is quite a short one. We're just going about seven miles probably down to Canterbury. A uh, little walk around Canterbury and we're done. We've got about probably another two walks after that. And we're back in the lovely medieval village of Chillum, which is absolutely gorgeous. So, North Downs Way, we're going through St Mary's in Chillum. There's a nice yew tree here. Yew tree has survived for 1300 years, it says here. It was fatally damaged by falling trees in the great storm oh, of 1987. So, this is what you want right at the beginning of a walk. It's a nice steady uphill curve. We're doing fine now, of course we are. Weather's yeah. very nice. It's fresh, but it's fine. Okay, we're in Old Wives Lees and we're going that way. Yeah. And we're heading down here. Okay. There's the signpost. I think we go over that style over there, don't we? Yeah. Stratton Park. Charlton Hatch, two miles. From more vineyards. Yeah, we're going through a few vineyards here as we head towards Chartham Heath. Oh, very nice. Water field. We've got another walker in front of oh, us. He slipped up there. Another walker in front of us. Oh, what a lovely field. That's a really nice little route up there. That's really nice. Yeah, we can go there and then across and then I think it's upwards. Okay. A bit sludge. Yeah. Might be a bit slushy this. Aha, uh -huh, we have a sign. Lucky we did go up this way. And north down the way. Cool. There we go. Okay, so we're going underneath the railway bridge. Pull this. Okay, this really is orchard country, isn't it really? Loads of some being grown. Uh, it's easy to, it's all signposted quite well. Okay. okay. Got to be careful on some of these. Because we've just come out into the road and a couple of fast moving vehicles. Outhouse. And the way. And we're going this way. Up Newtown Street. So a bit of road walking here, Newtown Street. So you've got to be on our guard. For any more fast moving vehicles. It's a lovely... Is it a white deer? A white deer? I'm not sure. Be, if anyone can answer, tell me who that is, we put it in the comment section. It's the A2 we're going to cross. We're crossing the A2. A2, yeah. Okay. We are in No Man's Orchard. About three miles outside Canterbury. Heading towards Bigbury. Bigbury. Which is an Iron Age fort. Oh, oh, he says. And there's an information panel. Oh, because I'm obviously very much into uh, Iron Age, Neolithic, which Bronze a, Age eras. It provides a vivid image, not just normal image, a, it's vivid, a vivid image <laughs> of what it might have been like in those days. <laughs> so look forward to vivid imagery coming up. Okay, cool. Wow. There may be vivid imagery. Yeah, keep watching, kids, keep Fla watching. Flash photography vivid imagery. <laughs> we'll head into the uh, No Man's Orchard. <laughs> we are in Bleen Ancient Woodland. Just trying to make sure we didn't see a sign. We think it is straight on. Yeah, if we hit a road, we're, we're good. There's an Iron Age Hill Fort nearby. Or the rains of one, but it's not in very good condition. You can probably hear the hum of traffic in the background because we're nearing Canterbury. Famous for the Canterbury Tales, of course, by Chaucer. The cathedral, world famous cathedral, the shrine of Thomas Beckett, who was killed back in 1170, was it? I think, by, on the orders of Henry II. Um, and a very ancient city. So we're at uh, Bigbury Hillfort, which is obviously up there. Remains made of prehistoric earthwork. At least from the latter part of the first century BC. Mm. And it's actually been masked by woodlands of South Bean, it says. Mm. But uh, yeah, that's it up there. 
we're not going up there, we're going that way, we're nearly in Canterbury, and it's nearly lunch time in the end, and then and we'll you see, how, you see how it goes up, and then it goes down again? Yeah, because the hill fort. Oh, it's funny, isn't it? Okay, we've got the A2 in the background, just came up the wood. Okay, in the alternative way. <laughs> and North Downs Way. Across the A2. Passing over the A2. It's showing such a load of landfill and people just thrown out of the cars. Especially when you're on a really nice little track like this, just by the uh, motorway. There we go. One mile. One mile. Someone said to me the other day, he said to me, um, how far to Canterbury? I said, one mile. He said, one mile. I said, aye, one mile. Roughly speaking. <laughs> Just going past the National Trust at Golden Hill. I don't know, which is over there. Must have some fine views towards the city. I would think, although we've got sort of houses all here, we're all sort of really in the outskirts now. Yeah. It's actually a very interesting update. Here we are, we're in Canterbury. I'll we'll show you some bits in a second. Just down the underpass, we've seen the cathedral, nearly there. John Fox underpass! Great old fire station, now converted into flats. It's worth pointing out that Canterbury is so synonymous with the North Downs Way that um, good to show you little bits of it. And there's Westgate. Oh, just no, gone through Westgate. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm heading I'm going to the high street. That's almost gone like yeah. yeah, we're not actually going into the cathedral, I'm afraid, guys, but. There is Canterbury Cathedral. Paul, a bit of a sort of. We're not actually going into Canterbury Cathedral, but it's, uh, and you can't really get a good shot of it. But here we are, Canterbury, we're in Canterbury Square, right by the entrance. That counts, doesn't it? Yeah. But yeah, it'd be shame nice to get a picture. But anyway, it's been a good journey, and two more to do, maybe. Yeah. And we might see you next time. <laughs>